sunglasses on the inside. Hey guys, Bike Blogger here. I've cleaned up my garage, so I'm quite happy. Still got the shelves over there. I got a table here, got rid of the bike boxes. Wall mounted bike uh, repair stand and a clamp there by Park. It's a really nice repair stand, very simple, really nice. Uh, so tomorrow I'm going to be riding my Wobby bike, this one right here. What do I do every night before I go for a ride the next day? I pump up my tires. Uh, overnight, you know, eight hours, I'm not going to lose that much air. So it saves me a few minutes in the morning to, you know, filling around with the pump and everything. By the way, this is a uh, Topeak Joe Blow pump. I like it a lot. So uh, thanks for watching, and uh, tomorrow we're going for that ride. So we'll see you probably in... Uh, uh, two seconds. Hey there, bike blogger here on my way to work in the morning. Today we're going to talk about clutter. And I want to go down here and see if, uh, see what's going on with the street down here. I think the street is closed. So I got a new uh, bicycle repair stand in my little workshop in my garage the Park PRS 4W-1. Let's see here. What's going on? Oh. Getting used to the clipless pedals again. Going back to clipless pedals. Yeah, it looks closed down there. Let's make a left. Yeah. Ah, actually, let's see how far we can get. Yeah, it's closed off. Take the detour. Ugh. So yeah, my new uh, repair stand that I got bolted to the wall. Really nice. It's out of the way. Now because it is along on the wall, it's not as easy to work on both sides of the bike at the same same time. But that's usually the case. You really gotta move the, turn the bike around anyway. So that's not really a big deal. Contemplating. I guess we'll go right. I didn't know exactly which way I wanted to go this morning. I think I was gonna go down Manchester. I guess I could still do that, make a left up here. I should have gone. I had my chance. Just missed my chance. So yeah, uh, clutter. I cleaned out my garage. I had uh, like three or four bike boxes and stuff. Came across a whole bunch of spiders. So yeah, don't leave uh, don't leave cardboard lying around like that for a long period of time. You're gonna create a huge spider's nest. And that's not fun. Stop. Manchester now. I think I do prefer clipless pedals. Going to platform I learned I have a great tendency to twist my leg around and stuff. Not very good cycling form. Clipless pedals keep me locked in and keep me in a somewhat 
proper position. I have no idea how fast I'm going because I still got to get a bike computer on this bike. If I had to guess, I'm going at a, a decent clip. Probably about 20 miles per hour right now. A heat wave has been hitting the U.S. A mountain biker, a 28-year-old female, died this last weekend, I think. Mountain biking in the southwest. I think it's southwest. It's southeast. went red up ahead. Hey, that rhymes. So I think we might make a right. We'll climb the hill. Water. Some of us are worse than others. I'm talking about hoarding. Collecting a bunch of junk. I think that's mainly a, I think that's a psychological problem. Oops. Wasn't really paying attention to the light back there. Pretty certain it was green though. So everyone's still going. Still climbing in the morning. Still doing work to my left. Construction work. Alright, we need to get over. So we're gonna zip it around here. All the traffic just piled up behind me. There we go. Bike Frogger. Be careful out there. More cars into the train. Is it gonna go up? Is the gate gonna go up? Is the gate gonna go up there, guys? Woo! Let's make a right. So, is your house full of clutter? Or is your room full of clutter? Do you have a storage? Are you renting extra storage? store all your junk. We have multiple storage units. Store all your junk. Do you have a second home? To store all your junk. If you own a farm and a barn, you store all your junk in the barn. Or you try to live a minimalist lifestyle. I did a video on that. Minimalism. Blah, 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 blah. me there. Thought I might have heard a train coming, but nope. Hot day today, like I said. Getting up to 95 Fahrenheit, which actually feels warmer because around here next to the Mississippi River, it's humid. 
And that humidity makes it feel worse. So make sure you go out for any length of time, bring some water with you. I think when climbing hills, it made most sense to sort of lean forward over the front wheel. That's of course absolutely not true. Especially if you're going up a big hill. I mean, there's absolutely no aerodynamic advantage. Because you know, the hill is blocking the wind for you as you're going uphill. So keep that weight over the crank. Also important when it's uh, slippery out, so you don't lose traction, keep some weight on the back wheel. Whew. Almost there. Almost to work now, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate all the comments. Subscribers, you guys are awesome. Guys and gals. Always like to see lots of views on my videos. I think usually after I post the video, after maybe a few days, a couple days, I've been getting almost, you know, like over a thousand views per video. So we've definitely gone up. So we're continuing to grow. No, this is sort of a niche video. Let that guy go. Truck pulling a car. One more stop sign. used to clip those pedals again. I do love them though. Check out my video, favorite pedals. Shimano XT's.